The Gratitude to God calendar for 2013 is ready to be shipped. We've been waiting for these, and they have arrived. They're in the new blue color. Now, 11 years ago, when I started this, I started it with a much larger calendar. Well, that didn't work so well because when you had something to record that you were thankful for, you might not have it with you. You might have it at home. This new calendar is pocket size. Also on the back, it has a built-in pen. And every day there is space for you to write down your blessings, what you're thankful for. This is what causes a life-changing event on a day-to-day -day basis. As you remember, as you recall, what you are thankful for instead of what you're not thankful for, the problems, the challenges. And you will find over time as you do this that the good overwhelms the bad. It absolutely will lift you out of any darkness that you might be in. Now, I'm not in the business of selling calendars. Uh, I want to urge you, though, to do this. If you're too late to get one of our calendars, you can get your own calendar. Any calendar works. It is just simply to have the time to sit down to recall, and to write down your blessings. I send this with a complete instruction sheet. Now, if you want to know about this in detail, I urge you to watch the Positive Church channel. In November, I talk about the Gratitude to God calendar for over 30 minutes, which, of course, I can't do here. Also, I talk about the first point right now in my lesson called Confidence of Access, about recording up arrow days and striving for those. Either a day is an up arrow day or a down arrow day. And as you begin to record these, you begin to take notice of what's working and what's not working. And you tend to, over a month or two time, produce more up arrow days in your life. And you will get to a time where you have only up arrow days, no matter what you're facing in the given day, because the good overwhelms the bad. Every day you will make an appointment with God for prayer, but it's a different kind of prayer. It's giving thanks prayer. Recording the blessings, and then giving thanks to God for these. You count your blessings. You write them down daily, and then you review weekly, review monthly, and then review yearly. That is the way that we spend Thanksgiving in the positive Christianity way. We spend the entire day giving thanks to God. Most people only give thanks for three minutes, three minutes during the meal that has been prepared, that is served during halftime. I'm asking you to do more because as you do more, it will change the entire perception and focus of your life. Next, you are thankful for your life. You love your life, and it's easy as you recount all the blessings that are currently in your life Next, you are thankful for you. Most people aren't. They are very, very critical of self. They stand in front of a mirror and they tear themselves down. Well, you begin to look and to magnify your good points. The next step, or step number nine, is you're thankful for other people. You give thanks for them. You record it on your calendar, and that changes your entire attitude towards others, and other people will feel that. Step number 10 is thanksgiving. You give back blessings for what you have received. Could be a listening ear, a smile, a kind gesture, a helping hand. 
you make yourself available in a way to thank God by thanking others. And then step number 11 is you praise only. Days that you can praise only instead of criticize, instead of being overly cynical. You put a star on that day and it helps to retrain your mind on what works. That's a simplified look at our system of our Gratitude to God calendar for 2013. I invite you to make your own calendar or order one of ours and turn your life around. I pray that your life in 2013 and the days ahead of 2013 will be filled with much to be thankful for, that you'll be overwhelmed by the good that is in your life. Good that was invisible to your eyes before is now clearly visible, remembered and recalled by you. In Jesus Christ's name we pray. Amen.